Hello everybody, I'm Lieutenant Guleroni. This will be my first vid in forever. Um, as you might know, um, I've been making vids before on this channel. Uh, I used to go by the name of Mr. Shizzable, uh, playing some Minecraft. But uh, I've taken some time to myself, a really long time. Uh, I've got a better computer, I've got a better mic. And we're playing some League. Uh, this is a ranked game I played. Uh, I'm playing Thrash because everybody called what they wanted and I'm like, whatever, I'll just play support. I like playing Thrash. Right here, we saw Leona coming in, so I hooked her. We just didn't know where the enemy was. So, right now, it's, we think we can fight until we see everybody coming in. So, I just pieced the hell out. I flash, I'm incredibly low. And we just back off to uh, t to our turret. Uh, they kind of wanted to chase, but they didn't really. I land the hook on Aatrox right here, so we trigger his passive. So that shouldn't be up for a bit. Uh, I don't know the cooldown on it, but whatever. It's their jungler. Um, I just go back to base. I started out with. Um, Let's see it with four regular wards and a pink ward. Uh, the reason I did that is because he have a Leona, and I, uh, I just wanted to have vision over in lane so we wouldn't get smashed as hard. Uh, they thought uh, our team thought they were gonna go grab our red, so they went to their their red. But the reaction of the enemy team was uh, rather good. They backed off and went to uh, their own red. And they grab first blood on this Cho'Gath. But you know, some people might call it GG, but I don't want that. So like, whatever, shit happens. We'll keep on playing. Uh, I've got a Varus with me, which is uh, a really strong anti carry in my opinion. They've got a Vayne, hyper carry, really strong late game. I put a ward down, so we got fishing over... Leona, I hit her once to trigger my pickpocket, get 3 gold, so that's good. Um, I kind of want to play this a little bit safe, because you know Cho'Goth does, uh, doesn't have as much lane press as, as Aatrox, in my opinion. Aatrox, however, has cleanse. So if I do hook him, he can always cleanse out, even though he, he used it already. Uh, if Cho'Goth uh, gets ahead, he can do whatever he wants, he'll be tanky as hell. But, you know, Varus is, uh, can, pl uh, can play, uh, I'm sorry, can play both passive as aggressive. Uh, we kind of want to shut his Vayne down, but I'm pretty confident it won't work as hard as we want it to. Let's just speed this up. Uh, I'm going to be focusing mainly on bot lane in the in this game uh, because it, uh, I like maining uh, I like Ada carry so I main that and support with it as well. Vayne is shuffling the lane so we can all in her. Uh, Jogoth is near but I'm not sure if I'll go for hook. I'm a little bit low. Get three gold from the pickpocket. Uh, Leona wants to go in. Right now she doesn't have anything but because the wave uh, is in their advantage I do not want to go in. Jogoth is Kind of close, but not close enough to do anything. It comes to tell him it's warded because she just pink warded. Alright, you guys gonna. I land the hook. Let's see, let's just back off a bit to see what happens. Uh, so they see him coming in. Leona stays too long, I guess. Uh, Cho gets condemned, but I still land the hook. Use everything on them. And. Able. No, no flash. That's good. <coughs> Whatever. Uh, we can. We should be able to force them out of lane right now. We have a bit of an advantage. Leon is gonna miss some experience and uh, probably didn't want to back that early because she doesn't have any gold. Uh, I'm full again. I pink ward her pink ward, so we got vision again, and they don't. Uh, too bad we didn't blow any summoners. Otherwise, I would have told Choga to come. Uh, gank again in a bit. Let's just turn the volume down a little bit. 
Um, so we're pushing into turret. He takes a tower head. That's okay. He should have fire steel. M maybe not Quince. At least he has the Dorians. I got condemned. She didn't hit the third proc of uh, silver bolts, which I'm, I was rather happy of because that would have dealt a lot of damage. And I'd be low. She's rather low, but our Varus isn't really the best AD carry, I think, uh, for laning. Uh, this Varus, at least, this this guy. Uh, I see Leona moving into this bush. I've got a warded, so it should be fine. I kinda want to ward this, bar, uh, this bush. Um, well, we're just playing it safe. Uh, Vayne is ahead, one level, and we see Lysandra coming in. Uh, I don't know why I missed that hook so bad. She still doesn't trigger a third uh, silver ball proc. So we're fine. Lysandra is low. Uh, Vayne is low. So we're kind of still playing aggressive. I, I'm not sure if I knew this was warded. Uh, but I guess we're gonna make a mistake right here. See, Lysandra is still staying. Uh, and is kind of pushing into our favor. And Lysandra uses ult. Uh, I'm not sure if it was me or whatever. I have to burn flash again just to get out, but whatever. They're both low. Vayne has to back. Varus, however, also has to back because we didn't know if Lysandra would camp it or not. Uh, so let's just speed it up a little until we're back into lane. I should use my lantern on, on Varus, but I'm not sure if I do it. Yeah. I, Oh, I'm sorry, my mouse just died. Let's just pause for a bit. I should be able to cut this out. Let's see. My mouse is is amazing. It's, uh, it's a Razer Ouroboros. It can be used both uh, wireless as wired. So as you can see right now, my mouse back up because I plugged it into the wire. It's, it should be fine right now. I'm sorry about that, guys. Aatrox is at our double golem, so I'm not sure if we just didn't see him or just didn't pay attention. Uh, let's keep this a little bit sped up. Uh, Cho'Gath's giving blue to rise. We get ganked right here. So again, I use Flay on Aatrox, so they couldn't do too much. They condemned me, which was not really too smart because he wasn't in the right position. And in a bit, we're going to make a mistake, I guess. The Sandra is coming uh, as well. So they can four man us. We see Lysandra, however, so we're gonna stay on the turret at least. We kind of want to back. Um, yeah, you know, we just move out. I'm not sure if I really make a mistake. I don't have ult yet. Ferris doesn't have ult yet, so they can really easily dive if Leona hits her combo, which she should. Right here, I die. Ferris dies, and they get two free kills. Fain hit her ulti, she has to flash and she gets executed however. Rouse comes in balls deep, triggers his passive, she'll be able to finish him off. Uh, she, uh, Lysandra even used uh, her ulti, but that's okay, he gets a kill. 1 for 2, it's in her favor, but at least we're still at even gold, even though they have t uh, a 2 kill advantage. Rouse picks, some, picks up some nice farm that we otherwise would have missed. Speed us up again so we can get back to lane. I've got my side stone right now where uh, Leona started her feeler stone first. Uh, I think getting side stone first is better most of the time. Unless you really can't get any gold in lane because you're getting crushed. You might want that that um, gold per uh, 10 or gold per 5 item. I threw my lantern into the bush because uh, I wanted to know if Leona was there. She wasn't. I put a ward down. So now I have vision over her. I'm 6, uh, Varus is 6. Vayne is a little bit ahead in damage because she has a little bit more attack speed and silver bolt. Uh, even though Varus has uh, his blight, which he didn't really level after level 1. He's maxing E first because he's gonna go for an infinity edge and not a bloodthirster. That's okay, it's possible uh, as long as you execute it well. Uh, he's taking a little bit of farm here, they're taking a little bit of farm. She misses the big creep, which is really in our favor. Um, I wanted to ward dragon, so 
if we do get four men again, they can't just do dragon without us knowing it. Um, Leona could have gone in there, I guess, if Faye had positioned better. But Faye was just in the back farming, so that's okay. Ferris is up in CS right now. Um, I'm doing re pretty good. I again proc my pickpocket so I can uh, get three gold. I procked it again on Vayne. I got condemned but I still hit it. She doesn't really do too much damage right now uh, as she can't use her cutlass. I proc it again. Which is something you really want to do as, as Thresh. I'm maxing my flay. I've also got two points into Dark Passage I guess because I just missed the button. As you can see the poke she deals to me. She'll be able to life steal it. But um, I've got regen anyways. I get stunned by the ult. Ferris misses his ult. So I'm pretty fucked right here. Uh, it's too bad that he couldn't finish Aatrox off even though yeah, his passive was on cooldown so whatever. My bad. Uh, I saw Aatrox coming and still was greedy. I could have did I have flash? Yeah, I could have flashed out of the uh, Leona L, but my reaction time was, uh, was too long. Jogath goes in for Aatrox, she kills him off because he went Catalyst and uh, the Spirit Stone. That's okay, he gets a kill. Kill for kill. <laughs> Even though they might have got one or two extra assists. Uh, Vayne gets uh, a nice uh, wave to push up even though he goes to help. And then just backs out. So he lost a little bit of CS for nothing, really. Uh, I'm back. Uh, they're all back. Vayne has uh, still the advantage. As you can see, he stunned him, so he's half. But I land the hook, so I can get a good kill. I ward this, even though I walked in it. So we get a free kill. I think that was uh, really well executed. Ferris then uses Cutlass for some reason uh, to where Vayne did. And uh, we're looking uh, to dive this, which uh, I will die, but Ferris should be able to pick up the kill. Um, as you can see right here, I, I used Flay to get him out. That was incredibly horrible, that, uh, that death sentence of me. Uh, so she's low, we force her out, take turret, uh, even though Ferris is low. There's a teleport coming in, we didn't see it because I didn't have a ward it. But it's, it's just a Shen. He shouldn't be able to do too much. I guess even though Varys is low. Um, so he lands his taunt, but I stun him mid taunt. Well, it was just Cho. I accidentally picked up the kill, but that's okay. Kills on supports, never bad. This was really bad by me. I wanted to ward this because I knew there would be someone there. And we might have been able to do Dragon. But. The Sandra just deals too much damage. She's now 2 0. Uh, that's okay. I'm not worth too much. Uh, oh, well, I was. Because I got the reset. Because uh, I grabbed that kill. But that's okay, you know. It shouldn't let you. Uh, it shouldn't bring you down too much. So we're back. Um, I'm gonna see. We got the advantage. Even though uh, Vayne has two kills, they both have a, a Blade of Rune King. Except Varys also has boots. And I think Thrash is just an overall better support than Leona is. We're back. I wore the dragon, uh, his ass, <laughs> like Chogath called it. Uh, he wanted me to water right here. But, uh, I wasn't sure if it was pinged or I wasn't sure if I would be able to go there at all, even. So I just pinged it in the den. Uh, so we at least had vision of it. I uh, take the soul. I, I'm at 38 souls right now, which uh, it can be better. That's okay, we didn't push the wave. Um, they get top. He uses his ult um, to proc the special, which is rather bad. But that's okay, he still killed him. Should be able to take turret in a little bit. Uh, we, since we already have bottom, we're at uh, gold advantage. Uh, together with uh, this. Elise is low, but they should be able to kill them right here. I flash over, he lands a 3 man on. So Elise dies, but they get Shen for it as well. Uh, I'm roaming to mid lane, because bottom is pushed, they're not there. And I kind of want to take this turret middle. Uh, Cho should be able to pick this up rather soon. Just right now, even. With Rise there. So, 
we move into mid lane, bottom is pushed. Uh, someone wants to do dragon, but I'd rather have this mid turret first, or at all, because it gives you just more map pressure and more the ability to push um, when you ace them or when you form and kill them. We see Aatrox coming in. Um, they decide to go in. I flay him uh, while he uses his Q. Chogoth comes in, doesn't land his, uh, his rupture. I missed my ult, which uh, was my bad, but that's okay, we still get the turret. Um, we should be able to do dragon right here. I told Chogoth to come, but he stayed a little bit too long. Uh, he should be able to get out, I guess. Maybe even get a kill. Oh, I stayed to help him. He uses his num num to kill him off. We can even kill this because we saw Rise teleporting in and we just get three kills. A double kill for Chogoth, so we can be really tanky and still do a lot of damage. And we can't really see the turret because there's n not really a wave. So and we just put a little bit of damage in it. Rise tanks it for a little bit because he has a rod of ages. Uh, so we we do take it. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't know if it, everything that happened in this game anymore because I just play too much. Uh, I told them to come bot because you know the waves a little bit pushed, and it will be a big advantage if we get the turret. And we tank it a little bit and then just back out as soon as we see them coming. We almost catch Aatrox again. Uh, at this point, Aatrox was uh, raging like hell. Because uh, his teammates were so bad or something. He's 1 in 4. So I, I really uh, think that he shouldn't be raging this hard. We got a free dragon right here. They kind of want to contest it. But Aatrox wasn't coming. And they just don't have enough damage. Even though we're low. And we have a choke out. So we just nom nom it. Uh... Right here with this engaged. He lands a two man taunt, so I should die right here. I don't have ulti, I guess. Um, Shen dies, Chogoth dies. Uh, I'm dead, but they just clean up. Ferris and Rice deal a lot of damage, and of course, Elise always does damage with uh, health percentage. So, I got a couple of kills right here. They're chasing Vayne, which. I guess Elise could have lived that uh, without killing Vayne, but whatever, shit happens. Um, let's see, let's just speed us up a little bit again. Rice is chasing, whatever, he could have helped pushing, but that's okay. Right now, as you can, uh, if you think about how bot went, we, we're kind of behind because they four man us, and I had to blow my fast early. To just uh, to get out of the fight but uh, we got dragon we got let's see three tur four turrets as to none of theirs uh, so we're eight thousand eight and a half thousand gold ahead we weren't sure about how much gold we were ahead we just knew we were ahead and we'll just play it as a team we know Atros can't really do much Lysandra does a lot of damage uh, Vayne starts doing a lot of damage, especially because Ferris, Ferris hasn't backed. He will now uh, pick up his boots too and a BF sword. So he can start doing a lot of damage. I put a ward down right here so we know if they want to move bot lane or as soon as they move from lane up to mid lane or whatever, we immediately, immediately see them coming instead of having to wait for them to pass this ward. I'm sorry, that's my phone. Um, I'm bot. I pushed the wave out a little bit so we can uh, put pressure on everything. I see pretty much everybody mid, so I like okay, we can fight this. So I just move to mid, support my team. Uh, they push this wave out. Everybody's near. Shen ulti is up, but Shen he went for his end, which I think is a really bad item as a first item. Uh, it should be used with a sunfire to uh, go split pushing but he's 0 and 4 he can't really buy that much just because we're so much uh, so far ahead uh, we just keep seizing middle uh, we're with 5 Lysandra's low Aatrox is a little bit low even though he should have his passive Shen isn't there uh, of course as Shen can just always split push I think he should just been there 
to maybe land the town so they could go in. I wore this so we have vision uh, of uh, them doing anything. Leona can't just go in uh, without us knowing. Um, we poke around a little bit. We're all pretty low except for Vayne and Shen. We're all pretty healthy. I'm a little bit low. I've got about 70% of my health left. Um, there was another bad hook of me. <laughs> I don't know why I was having such bad luck trying to land hooks. Uh, Elise flashes out. I use my ult so they can't get to Elise or Ferris. And it's just clean up right here. Elise jumps on Vayne so we can kill her. And we even pick up Aatrox. So the only kill we didn't get was on Leona because she had to back. She was too low. We got a turret. We got an inhibitor. And we should move bot right now. Because it's already pushed and it's just another free turret we should be able to take. I ward this. So uh, as soon as they move out of base we, sh uh, we are able to know where they are going. Uh, see we ping bot turret so we can go there. Pick up that... Uh, Another free tier, more global gold, uh, 150 gold and a little bit of experience for every member on our team. Uh, we have pretty good wave clear with Cho'Goth and Elise and Varus too. So we pick up this. Uh, we kind of want to back, but Cho'Goth went in and they just decided to engage on us. <coughs> in a little bit. I throw my letter so Cho would be able to get out, but since he's the tank he should be able to do just fine. As you can see they engaged us, I let the hook on Lysandra. And she basically just dies almost instantly. Chen gets there, taunts rise. We get stunned. That's okay. Uh, we kill off him. Fane. Okay, Elise died. That's whatever. Uh, we still have Ferris. Ferris deals a lot of damage right now. So, we ace them again. We take Butter again. Just for an Elise. We're all low. Uh, we were low before that fight. Well, we could turn it around because the bo focus was really bad. And Aatrox just can't do anything. He uh, bought mobility boots uh, along with home guard so he can get to us really fast. But he can't do any damage or sustain anything. So we take this turret, get more gold. Cho'Goth uses his passive to uh, get a bit tankier again, get some health up. Um, Ferris else, Lissandra, which you know, isn't the best. Aatrox again just goes in. For no apparent reason, he, he can't really do much against us all. Uh, Rise gets shut down. I pick up the kill on Vayne, if you could see that. Let's just slow it down a little bit. Because, uh, you know, even though I had the oracles, uh, or maybe I didn't, I see Vayne really low. I'm like, well, let's just uh, turn the attention to me so my teammates can escape. Even though I was, I was 4 and 4 before. I still get uh, a kill on that vein, so they can't push. Um, three for two, that's okay. I pick up another oracles or my first oracles, whatever. My teammate is back, at least back up. Speed us up a little bit again. They pick up a dragon, so more gold. We're let's see, is this fourteen thousand gold? Fourteen and a half thousand gold ahead. I pink Baron because I knew we would be able to do it really easily they don't have too much magic damage apart from Lysandra and uh, as you might not know Baron lowers your magic resist so it shouldn't really just go for Baron if the enemy has uh, uh, something like a, uh, a cannon Cho'Goth kills Shen for free just because he deals so much damage he went for Rylai's Rod of Ages I asked him, asked him if he would go for ages before the game started uh, but since he's not uh, I should have so much gold that the next time I back I should be able to buy it in one hit you see Aatrox going for top turret uh, he's not worth much gold so I kinda wanted to let him he proc this passive in a bit he's just not doing anything, he's raging, he's demoralizing his own team he's not even trying to take turret until now uh, and he gets executed, at least was just a little bit too late. But because Aatrox is dead, Vayne is bought because of uh, all the super creeps, mid is pushing really hard. We got another free turret, just extend our gold lead and we will be able to take the game not too long from now. Uh, now the Ferris is here, we got uh, a great 
uh, ability to push. Uh, I'm not sure if I saw that ward uh, being placed by Leona, but she's backing off right now. I'm not sure Elise should be able to catch her. Nope, she's just a little bit too late. Her E doesn't deal damage, so she couldn't stop her. But still, uh, it put their attention to Leona. I get stunned, Rose gets slowed. Was a really bad ulti, I guess. I used my flay incredibly weird. And as you can see right now, I'm just peeling for Varus. I know Varus deals a lot of damage, as does Lissandra. So I'm just peeling for Varus so he stays alive. And he should be able to just live barely. As you can see, he has about 80 health and the ignite taking. He goes down to 13, but he'll still live. Or not. I thought he lived. That's okay. Uh, we got super creeps in the base. We take a third inhibitor. They shouldn't be able to turn this around at all because their team fighting is bad. Their focus is bad, and they're just so far behind. We just take the nexus turret, take the nexus. I flash to land the hook. If you want to see that again, I'll just jump, jump back for a bit. Uh, let's see where am I? There I am. <laughs> I'm not sure why I was standing still, but that's okay. Right here, I flash to land the hook. I wanted to flare her, but I didn't want to kill her, so Elise was a little bit late, but she still killed her. We got the ace, uh, raise KDA of Elise a little bit. She, uh, Rise teleports in. Ferris is dead, but that's okay. We take the Nexus, win the game. And I think our team played out really well, aside from the enemy team playing incredibly stupid, <laughs> if I may say so. So yeah, that's a victory. We got like 27 league points because it's only silver 3 I'm sorry guys I'm not a pro but I think a lot of people can learn from this I kept motivating my team I call them sexy mother monsters uh, along with the the heart and that you can do you know the ASCII keyboard whatever so I just kept motivating uh, their Aatrox kept demoralizing their team which is why we got a rather easy win even though we were a little bit behind in the early game. Um, I want to thank you for watching. As I said, this will be my first video in forever. So uh, uh, I would really appreciate it if you uh, left me a like or shared it to your friends or something. And hopefully you learned something from it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you later.